I found this funny YouTube video, a Wile E. Coyote, I'm 48, I'm not sure if you watched this when you were a kid, but it kind of represents to me what's going on in the stock market. Uh, gravity usually takes over quicker, but in the markets they can remain irrational longer than you can remain liquid. And I'll go over why I, it, it seems like that price is the ultimate, uh, is the ultimate fundamental, but watch this funny video and how slowly it takes gravity to take, o take over, reminds you of this straight up market. And this could represent QE1, QE2, QE3, and eventually gravity takes over. So just a little bit of a funny video from, um, from, the, from the 70s and 80s. We don't really know long term uh, what Fed stimulus has done. But if you look at the NYC tick today, the broader market, uh, we, we made a video about this earlier and it was narrow then. But now we have a situation where there's more negative uh, ticks, minus 502 versus plus 466, and it's just in a downtrend, and, um, and the advanced decline line is, is trending down as well. It's not really strong. The market is just you know going up, going up to new all-time highs, and if you're a trader, we have our strategies are long, and so we're not, uh, we're not shorting this market, but we're long with this trend, and, um, but it's just interesting to note that you know with all the Fed stimulus and market divergences, the market continues higher, and it seems like there's a gravitational effect that will eventually take place, and I thought that was a funny video that kind of represents uh, what I am seeing in the market eventually. We have strategies to go long and short, so it should be interesting.